you to the kitchen. Well, you wanted me to surprise you, and surprise! Mm. As a of fact, I'm impressed. Mm. Oh, and it looks good too. Yes. Sure thing. <laughs> oh, my friends are going to love this. <laughs> Water to cook this soup. The amount of salt in this thing can damage anybody's organs in less than two minutes. It's not it, it's not it. Thank you, I get. You expect me to thank you for this poison? You know what? Comes your wound enough. Enough. Jesus Christ, what do you want me to do? I've been in this kitchen all day, slaving away, trying to please you. And in one minute, you just you just come in and ruin it all for me. Like what, what do you expect me? What do you want from me? I'm trying, God knows I try my best. What do you want from me? But you and you you just keep nagging and nagging and nagging. You just a nag and a petty human being. You, you know what? If you and your friends are not going to eat this food, then you make something by yourself. I'm tired, you are after you know handicap. I'm tired, not even a thank you. Chinese restaurant. I'll meet you guys there in a bit. Bros, do you want to end up in the hospital? Then just do what I said, okay? I'll meet you guys there. You are supposed to have dinner with your husband and his friends. That stupid man. That idiot that calls himself my husband. He has overdone it. So he has overdone it this time. Sophie, calm down now. Stop with the name calling. What happened? Can you imagine? After, after everything that I went through, slaving in the kitchen, putting in my very best, just to cook food for him and his friends. Imagine that man. That, that stupid man. Came, in, came into the kitchen, looked at me, 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 Sophie, and said that I cook poison. Poison? <laughs> Who said that to I don't understand. Wife? I thought you followed my every instruction. I did. And so what happened now? <laughs> Everything you said I should do, I did this. I don't know. I don't ah. know. Maybe that time I was asking you the quantity of salt to put. <laughs> you did not tell me. Eh? <laughs> now use my discretion. I don't know. I must have overtold me. Oh, oh no. no. Ah, ah, Sophie, are you a child? You should have tested it now. You should have known the quantity of salt to put. Go test them. If it's too much, you go know. It's obvious she didn't, she didn't, she didn't test it. Eh, eh, I she guess you didn't tell her. You see a child? Mm -hmm. No, you just tell her. Like now, can you be? It's in bed. I beg, I beg, I beg. You don't say. When you were, when, when you were telling me this thing, when you did not tell me, Sophie, when you put, just put small salt, put small salt, then you taste it. Ah, when did you tell me? See, no, leave me alone. The, the internet that I was looking at, we did not put in everything in quantity. You did not tell me anything. Now, see what you have caused. This is not your fault. The earlier started taking responsibility for your mistakes. Never. That is when you start getting your desired help. What do you mean? The truth of the matter is, right now, you blame everyone but yourself for the things that happened to you. <laughs> Come to think of it, Seth. Who trained you? <laughs> Sophie, who trained you? <laughs> well, like, if I see her mother right now, I will tell her how disappointed mm -hmm. I am. Mm -hmm. yes, I no, no, no. She has filled her head with so much rubbish mm -hmm. that nothing good can come out of her. Nothing. Yes, leave yes, me yes. at the vex. I beg, leave me. <laughs> come back. Uh -uh. No, no, no. It's not nice. No, you won't I'm blame Sophie. No. Esther, you won't blame Sophie now. You won't blame her. She grew up having the maids do everything for her. I beg. That is why she can't even tell the difference between her left from her right. Her mother filled her head with that rubbish of it's a man's uh, 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 responsibility to take care of his wife instead of the other way around. That is why she could not even uh, uh, use her discretion to say, okay, this is the quantity of salt I should put in a food. Did you not come out? In fact, I'm even impressed she even made an attempt. Did you not come out? <laughs> you tried. Use your hand and your No, you tried, you tried, you tried. <laughs> 
Mister, please, I'm tired. Please, I had a very long day. I just want to sleep. You're tired? From doing what? Cooking. Cooking? You call that pot of rubbish that you prepared cooking? That thing that any imbecile can prepare in less than one hour. So that's your excuse for denying me sex right now. What's wrong with you? Did you have to make a fuss about everything? Okay. Let me ask you. How I'm talking to you. Talk. How many times have we made love this month? Maybe once or twice. Once or twice. I'm glad you remember because I can't remember. I don't know why you always do these things. Why? You, you try to make me feel bad all the time. You, you know I'm not a sexual person, so, so why do you always have to make me feel bad? Why? Can you, can you listen to yourself? You're not a sexual person. You don't contribute to my business like any working class lady would. You don't clean up the house like a good housewife would. You don't make love to me like a, a good prostitute would. So tell me, Sophia, Olale, Obuna, what is your uh, 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 purpose in my life? Good question. Kamsi, if I am your bona, I am your wife, not your cook, or your help, or your prostitute, like you said. So, please, I beg, I am not in the mood. Let me just lie down and sleep. I don't want to have sex. When you were touching me, did you see me raise my bum bum to tell you that I wanted it? I didn't do anything now. Let me sleep. Can't I sleep? Ah, that we're married. Is it every day we're doing it? Every day, most we be doing it every day. Believe me, when you're there insulting me, insulting my cooking style, I cook poison. You do not know that in the night you come and meet me, him, baby, baby. When when do we do it? If you if you do it without my consent, it's rape. Sophie, please, please, you need to calm down. I need you to calm down, right? See, every every marriage has its own issues. Do you understand? Eh? Eh? I need you to calm down now. You don't have to give up this soon, please. What, what does he want from me? What does, what does he want me to do? I, I understand. He, he complains about everything. I see. know, I know. It, even me, I'm, I'm really surprised that Kamsi. I'm surprised at him because that's not the person I know. For me, I, I think there's something deeper. I don't know, but, but let's just tell me. I mean, I mean if, he doesn't, if he doesn't want me anymore, he should just tell me. After all, the marriage no. is only a year. No, no. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. It hasn't gotten to that part. No, 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 no. It's okay. 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 Why don't you just try and see how you can fix some of the challenges, some of the things he complains about? <laughs> I can't 
Ah, oh, come on, Sophie. Ah, uh ah, -uh, try first now. Why don't you just try? Stop crying. Uh, stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> stop crying. Where's my hanky? Stop crying. Stop crying. Uh, stop. Stop crying. Stop crying. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Why would a beautiful girl like you? Do you know how beautiful you are? Oh, look at her. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Uh, don't cry again. Don't cry again. Hmm? It's okay. Where have you been? I've been looking for you. I'm just coming from a meeting with your wife. Sophie? No, Sapphire. What is she complaining about this time? No, you should tell me what the problem is. I don't understand. I met your wife and she was in tears. Oh, she's very good at that. I just wonder why she's not an actress. Come on, man. Don't you want your marriage to work? Eh? I don't know where you're driving at, but if you know what I go through, eh, then you will understand my point. Because I wonder what I saw in that girl. Uh, she's beautiful, that's what you saw. She's beauty without brains. She's a bimbo. Dude, you need to focus on this marriage and make it work. Period. Focus on this, your marriage. Let it work. Focus on it, let it work. Calling me into a nag. <laughs> you see? So, that is your present excuse for your recent behaviors, Abby? Abby? I'm not a nag, bro. You need to work hard to make me believe that. What does that even mean? So we cook in here, me and my girlies, can you see? Uh -uh, Sophie, do you want to put your head inside the food? Uh -uh. Every time it's selfie, selfie, all this selfie you're taking and explode, exploding, uh, what, what's that word? Uploading. Uploading on social media, looking for likes and followers. If you spend half this time in learning some basic house shows, yo, you'd have way gone in saving your marriage. Loretta, now we talked about this already. Oh, yes, we did. And I'm not liking it. I am not liking it at all. Calm down. What is it? Stay happy. Calm down now. See, we're busy cooking something nice for her husband. Instead of her to pay attention, she's busy taking She doesn't even, even care. But I'm here, right? What, what, what do you want me to do? I'm so not here. Okay. What she's trying to say is attentiveness. A little attentiveness. See how she's trying to show you how to be able to cook for your husband. It's not like I'm married to him. They don't need right to See how she's trying to show you how to cook. Mm. You're not even paying attention. You're taking selfies. If you spend this time uh, that you're doing this, this nonsense to learn how to cook, it will be better for you, my dear. Don't get to just yelling at me. Why? Why? Go work, go That's go what work. friends do. They help friends out. Besides, <laughs> God, I wasn't meant to cook. Like, I wasn't built for the kitchen. I mean, I mean. And neither are you meant for the other room, right? Ha, <laughs> girl. <laughs> I got that department of love. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like that's that's Baby, don't try me, baby. You know what the last time he did it? Ha, honey, that man, he knows what he's doing. He's just pushing me up because he knows the right person to push up. Uh, I'm a drop it, drop it, drop it. <laughs> God, stop being a boy. No. Jesus Christ. Is it no, right, stop. Now he's spending your night with you. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, Lord, stop it, guys. Let's stop just it. have fun. Let's take pictures and just have a good time. You know? My followers need to see these things. I'm telling you. Like they would ah, so much traffic. Hey, Sophie is cooking. It's like queen. Hey. Ah. Let's go, baby. This, this is your fault. You're the one spoiling her. Okay, one well, selfie and then I will pay attention. Sophie. All right.
not appreciate the fact that I gave him a good meal last time. Saying, oh, he knows that I didn't cook the food. Imagine that. <laughs> That's because your husband knows you too well. No, it is because he finds fault with everything that I do. I might as well have been, he might as well have even seen me. Eh, eh, calm it down. Still Sophie, calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Let's tell ourselves the truth. I decided not to talk about this whole thing with you before, but as we did right now, I could talk about it. Look, there are very few good men in this world. Ah, and your husband, I can't say, is one of them. So if you do anyhow, you will lose him. You will lose him, Hi. oh. Hang hey. Tell her the truth. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Do people think it is easy to live with Kamsi? Why are all of you looking at him doing, saying this thing? Like I'm one that is crazy. Do you think it's easy? I bet none of you could even think. You cannot last with him one day. Hey, you think your husband is difficult? He's a difficult person. He is not. It's because you're lazy. Okay, hey, hey, lazy. Loretta, Loretta, I don't want to say. Tell yourself. It's you. okay. It's okay. Don't make her feel like she has built a reputation. You're almost right. <laughs> Pastor, don't worry. May she don't put my cost me. Love me, love my dog. <laughs> I think I'm lazy. I'm difficult. Do you think marriage is easy? Do you think it is easy? Question. Marriage has its ups and downs. But you, on your part, are not even doing anything at in all. making your own marriage work. Not trying at all. You know they try you. Wow, wow, wow. Mm -hmm. You know they try. Wow, who? The spinster gives marriage advice. You don't matter for yourself. Baby. You, Loretta, that cannot even handle one small sign of relationship. <laughs> small like this, you know, feel handle. Then you are coming to tell me. You want to sit down and tell me how to be a wife. Sophie. She has not said anything bad. You don't have to remind her of her marital ability like, status. Okay. Come on, now, she talk. That but that is the truth. Yeah. No, no, but come to think of it. You see fault in every other person but yourself. You complain this, complain that, my husband this, my marriage that, but you don't even think about yourself. Ah, you just feel your husband is not good enough to, to, to stay with a woman. Meanwhile, she's the difficult person here. You don't tell me say, man love dog, I've waiting that thing you talk. Don't you tell me difficult, tell me terrible. Abby, because of this one marriage, you know what? I want you to go and be my husband's wife. For one day. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Nobody that she's just a joke. <laughs> I talk with her, I talk laugh. I'm not joking, I'm actually being serious. I want Loretta to be my husband's wife. She should act as my husband's wife for one day. You know, it's fine. I'm very genuine. You know, if you make her generous, like yes, I will make it three days. You will be my husband's <laughs> wife for three days. And if Kamsi does not nag, then you win. And I know Sophie is the one with the problem. But if he nags, if he as much as does, when, then I win. Loretta, I am using God to beg you. If that happens, eh, that means you, your mouth like this, zip for my marriage for her. Are you mad? What kind of sick game is that? Why are you so scared? Why are you people scared? I have, I have given you for an opportunity. Okay, let us do it. Let me let the matter die. So that if I am now the horrible person, I will know the whole world. In fact, you know what? I will even tell my fans that I am the one with the problem. Yes, I have agreed. She's just shaking like a leaf. I beg, I beg, I beg. If people are not going to help me get better my situation, at least people just listen to what I'm saying. Don't come and make my matter worse. I agree. I will take up the challenge. Correct. Okay. Good. No. Are you okay? No, I am not mad. <laughs> But so if you just sit down here, they choke me out. Mm. But I will prove to her, say, mm. I am capable of so many things. Mm. This is capable. This is I can of keep me. a marriage comfortably, very well, more than this. This is an activity you like the marriage. Mm. Mm. So come and show me. So, see, no start mm. you cannot finish. Nothing there. No start stop. This is your marriage. You're putting a bet on your marriage. Mm -hmm. Sophie. Mm. Talk, I am not here. Oh. Don't worry, you will be here. You will be here when she will come back crying like this and say, Oh, Sophie, you were right. Don't worry about it. I know the shake. I know the man will marry me for house. Uh -huh. Loretta, 
Give me stars. Okay. Put your hand on my hand. Let us know because I don't want that to bother someone to come and send me a message and say, hey, Sophie, I thought you were joking. Let us seal this deal. Oh. You will Sophie. go and wipe my husband. Sophie. Hey, you understand? Stop that. Your mouth. Hey, hey. Talk to your husband and no let me know. It's on. The game is on. And after that, if I hear anybody call Sophie again, we put the person on Instagram. Meanwhile, let's take a selfie. Sophie, this is a very expensive gift. Yeah, I don't like it. I really don't know what you're thinking. Yes, I'm thinking this kind of thing. I am not joking. I'm being very serious. I need to know who's got the gift. Like my husband knows. To the point of making Loretta stay with your husband. And leave it to you as a wife. Wait. I'm not even confusing myself. A wife will do everything. I don't want to sleep with your husband. I don't know the details. She, she should do any and everything. As she thinks the most of me. So let her go and do it and teach me. I'm just all I'm saying. She should teach me how to be a wife. I don't know if you know what she has done. This whole thing. I just pray it doesn't backfire. There's some more things to do for me. Something I would love to discuss with you. What is it? It's about you always complaining that I'm giving you nag. Sophie, okay, I don't have time for your silly talk. You can say I just got back right now and I want to freshen up, find myself something to eat and rest. <laughs> can you at least listen to what I have to say first? Loretta and Esther seem to think that I am the reason you are always nagging. Finally, thank God, someone knows the truth. Please, just listen to what I have to say, even if you don't agree. So, I have come up with a plan that would deal with this issue once and for all. I spoke to Loretta about it, and she and I have agreed to swap places for three days to see what your reactions would be like. And if you do not nag and accept that I am the issue and I'll do everything to make our marriage work. But if you nag, then you will do anything and everything to make this marriage work. I don't understand. What do you mean swap place? I'm saying Loretta will be your wife for three days. Are you serious? Come, is she crazy? Ah, what, what is she thinking? The worst part is that she thinks it's my fault. She doesn't see anything wrong in a wife that cannot cook or clean the house or do anything to make her husband happy. Hey, even the way you talk, what did you say? What was your take? What do you think I would say? I was stunned. I was flabbergasted. I was, I was in awe. <laughs> well, well. Actually, me, I think it's a good idea. I think it's a very fantastic idea. Because you even, you've changed. Ha, ah, you've changed. Maybe it's an opportunity for you to know what the root cause of this whole problem is, you know? That kind of thing. You know, looking into like this, I'm tempted to take up this offer. Because I need to know if I am the one that is a nag, or she's the reason why I nag. Yes. You have to know what the rules are. Exactly. Exactly. That's it. Though I, I just wish <laughs> the result comes out nice. <laughs> Baby, I called you all here because my wife told me about your little game. Which I sincerely do not agree with. <sighs> it's totally unheard of. But you see, ever since I married your friend, I've not been able to recognize myself. So, I want to use this as an opportunity to prove that I am not a nag. No, you're not going to do this. Please, you will not agree to this. Marriage is no game. Esther will do it. Three days. 
Three days and will make a difference in all our lives. <sighs> Baby, I knew you would agree to this. Hmm? Now, after this experiment, we all will know who is who. <laughs> What are the rules of the game? Uh, oh. None. No rules. What? <laughs> mm -hmm. You just do what a wife does with and for her husband. Do you know what you're saying? I doubt. Uh, guys, please. You don't want to just be so melodramatic. I know, all right? I'm aware of what I'm saying. But I do not want Loretta to tie her epic fail to the rules. So, no. Wait, what, what is all this? What is all this? I think I've gone mad or something. What, what, what is all this one? Okay, okay, in fact, I have accepted to do this. I'm going to do it. So, when do we start? Oh, tomorrow. <laughs> Fine. But Good. that will not be fair on Loretta. She's a working class lady and not a full housewife like you. Mm. Loretta, it's not a challenge. Don't worry. I will beat Sophie to this game. Ooh, I love the enthusiasm. <laughs> Ladies, game on. Um, really, come back. Let's take a picture. Let's take a selfie. Don't be so serious. Let's take a selfie. No one dies. Are you sure you really want to do this? There's still time to back out too. Eh? And allow Sophie to taunt me for the rest of my life? <laughs> no way. You know how she behaves. I know Sophie did this on purpose. She purposely pushed me to the wall so that she would see how I would react. But I'm going to show her that I'm capable of so many things. But you should know Sophie. She's not a serious girl. She sees everything in life as a game. And I'm going to play this one with her. I just hope this whole thing is not um, because of your boredom from leaving Harry. Because after you left him, you've never seen anything sacred in life. It's not about Harry. And please, keep that name far away from my ear. Please. Stop, please, now. I need your support, not taunts. Please. Are you not worried that Loretta is at your house right now with your husband? Uh, no. And you are not bothered to be spending the night together in the same room? <sighs> oh, darling. Are you worried on my behalf? Don't be. My husband, Kamsi, has the eyes for just me. And besides, <laughs> what can Loretta possibly have that Kamsi would be interested in? <sighs> Are you stupid? Are you so stupid or you're just being dumb? <laughs> the person I pray for, don't take life too seriously. When you take life seriously, you start saying things like this now. You need to get your eyes checked. Because in case you have forgotten, I am the slave queen. 
the one and only Slay Mama on Instagram. But you wouldn't know anything about that, right? <laughs> huh? Imagine my husband comes to you and Loretta together. Oh, please. Oh, my. What now? It's no fair. Every time you like to fight me. Oh, Jesus. You want to sleep on the couch? No. You're my wife, and my wife doesn't sleep on the couch, so. Go. Get to bed. Go. Time for morning prayer. <sighs> Jesus, blessed Jesus. I love your name. I love your name. Jesus, blessed Jesus. I love your name. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I can see all of Kakuzi. <laughs> wait, 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 what's up? Dude, what's up? This one that you are this lively, I don't understand. What's up with our little game? What's up?
if this is how games are played, I don't want to ever stop playing this game in my life. How do you mean? Bro, my breakfast is ready on time. My clothes are ironed and waiting for me on the bed. And Loretta is a good cook. Wow. Wow. I'm gonna have on your day now. I'm gonna have on your day. But don't be carried away. You know it's a game. Don't be carried away, brother. This is one game I don't want to stop playing. Eh. Uh -huh. It's now. Uh -huh. Don't go there. Go away. You don't enter the place. Enter which place? Guy, you don't go to Jerusalem. Ah. Uh -huh. uh -huh. What do you mean by that? Are you not the one that said that there are no rules? Eh, but if I do that, that is uh, cheating on my wife and that's not my style. What do you mean? She's the one that told you anything, you can do anything. Come on, you saying that me, man. I thought I'll go like three times. Bro. I don't know what you're saying. Mm. Uh -huh. Hi, babe. How's it going? So fine. Everything is okay. I'm fine. How are you doing? And how's Sophie? We are okay. How is Gamsy? Has it nagged? Oh, no. Nagging. <laughs> babe, I'm telling you, Sophie is the... She's a problem to herself and to her husband. She, she need to see the way this guy was eating the food I cooked. That girl, that, that girl has not cooked anything good for that man for weeks. <laughs> Work is fine. Um, it's okay. I'm in the office right now. But I, I'll call you later, okay? Alright, no problem. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Hello? How's my wife doing? <laughs> She's very well, thank you. Um, I was just calling to check up on you. How's your day going? Well, it's going very well. How's yours? Very well. Oh, I'll see you later. Alright, see you later too. Bye. So how was your day? It was fine. I enjoy the food. Are you asking? <laughs> How do you learn to cook this good? Do you know when last I ate food like this? It's been years. My mom taught me. Maybe I need to make. You need to what? 